Hey guys, it's Greg, the Frozen Food Master, and you're joining me as I eat my way through the freezer aisle one box at a time. Mini Philly cheesesteaks shaped like paninis. Will they be any good? We'll find out in this episode of Freezer Burns. If you spend some time on freezer burns, then you might stave off the stomach churns. Greg's the Frozen Food Master. He's best bud to your taste buds. Hi, welcome to Freezer Burns. I'm your host, Greg, the frozen food master. Today, we're reviewing this. Brand new from Farm Rich. It is the mini Philly cheesesteak, around $7 a bag. Now I say $7 a bag, but Farm Rich has actually sent me this bag to try out their product, so it was free for me. Okay, what does it say on the outside? Cheese, onions, and beef in a crispy crust Sounds very, very simple to me. Approximately 12 to 15 sandwiches in this bag. Let's take a look at that bag. I'm gonna try to straighten it out so you can see it on the outside. What does it look like? Well, to be honest, the food photography on the outside is not that great, but what do I see? I see some like caramelized onions. That looks nice. I see a nice golden flaky crust. They're almost like mini paninis, I guess, or um, like a flatbread sandwich that's folded in half. Net weight is 21 ounces. That's 1.31 pounds. Here's how it looks coming out of the bag. It's definitely triangular. I haven't taken geometry in a while. Is this isosceles? It's definitely not equilateral. I know that much. Okay, what do we got going on here? It's lightly brown in color on the outside. Here it is, a little close up. It is chalky. Definitely like I'm picking up the flour. Now, the first thing I noticed when I opened the bag, bam, it hit me with this like hardcore beef and onion smell. I really dig it actually, it smells really amazing. But when I took it out and I'm, I'm holding this, it feels very doughy. Now on the bag, it looked like it was like more flaky type crust. We're gonna see how it looks when I come, when I take it out of the microwave. Now, right on the outside there, you see just a little bit of gray peeking out, right? Right there in the little hole, it's gonna vent properly while in the microwave uh, for that. Serving size is two pieces. I'm gonna get this on a plate, and when we come back, I will show you how it looks, explain how it smells, and then we're gonna get this into my belly. Welcome back. So I've taken this out of the microwave. I cooked it for one minute and 15 seconds on a microwave safe plate uncovered. This is just for two of them. And here is how it looks. As you can see, some of that cheese has started to peek out, kind of um, squirt out a little bit, but you know what? It's a very nice, supple consistency. It's not liquidy. This is made with 100% American cheese. Now on the outside of the bag, it actually says 100% real American cheese. I don't think they needed the 100% plus the real, but hey, they wanna really emphasize it's 100% and it's real. Wow. Very thick. Um, first off, that's not how it tastes. It tastes amazing. This cheese, I mean, this, I mean, you can tell the difference. This cheese is really good. The flavoring is nice. It is, it's, um, it's not overly salty. Uh, it feels fresh. It feels like great ingredients. I really like this, guys. This is the brand new Farm Rich Mini Philly Cheesesteaks. Around $7 for this bag. Once again, I got this for free. I really like this product. I don't think it's perfect, but I think it's pretty amazing, okay? Good quantity for, for a serving, although I could eat two to three times the amount. This is still a filling, filling meal slash snack. Very easy to prepare, and the ingredients, very solid, okay? The cheese, great cheese taste. I don't even know what kind of bread that was. It wasn't really a bread, it's not a roll, it's not a biscuit. All I can say is it was thick, it was soft, it was not dry, it was nice and moist, and I really dig it. I give this a four out of five star. Question of the day. Now this is a mini Philly cheesesteak. I really like cheesesteaks, and this is eensy weensy weensy. What would you like, what do you love that's big that you would like to see eensy weensy weensy weensy? 
That's a technical term, eenty weenty weenty registered R. Leave that in the comments section or call this phone number. That's the Hungry Nation hotline and give me an audio recording. Tell me, let me hear your voice. What do you like that's eenty weenty weenty? All right, as always, I'm your host, Greg, the frozen food master. This has been another review of Freezer Burns. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.